Hey, Dr. Joe Feuerstein with the MD Minute. Thanks for tuning in. And today, a quick MD Minute just published by researchers at the University of Illinois. It was published at a large nutrition meeting in Chicago, Illinois. So there is quite a lot of research on soy, which is a protein. It's tofu, it's tempeh, it's soybeans, edamame, lots of different uh, types of soy products. And we know from adults that um, it can be good for your brain, that it can help with processing of the brain, how quickly we think and process things. But what they did in this study is they took 128 kids older than seven years old and they looked at them and then they looked at their diet over a seven day period and they did some tests. They did an intelligence test and they did a test for um, processing, even using an EEG. And what they were looking at is whether there was a relationship between how much they consumed soy products like tofu, tempeh, edamame, the soybeans, and whether that had any effect in these kids on intelligence or on processing. And what they found was though it didn't make any difference in terms of intelligence, it did seem to make faster processing speed. So they talked about how much you need and they're recommending about 30 milligrams of soy a day just to give you frame of reference. If you take a cup of soy milk, that's about 28 milligrams of soy isoflavones. Those are the, the, the active antioxidant compounds. And if you take tofu, it's about 35 uh, milligrams of soy isoflavones for a serving of tofu. So my take on this is that soy has a lot of health benefits. It's got antioxidants. It's got all the amino acids we need, and it may even help in processing not only for you, but for your kids. Dr. Joe Feuerstein with the MD Minutes. Thanks for tuning in.